New at six, questioning Mobile City leaders about the removal of the phrase Black Lives Matter spray painted on the cannon at the loop. Now we've been asking for days why it was taken down on Juneteenth, a day that commemorates the end of slavery. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey is live tonight. Andrea, you finally got a response from the city in the last hour. Uh, that's right, Kim. And it was last Thursday that someone had painted Black Lives Matter right there um, on the cannon here at the Loop. The very next day, city crews painted over it. Now, some on social media were upset the city did this so quickly. And as you mentioned, Kim, of all days on Juneteenth. Now, it's not uncommon for the cannon to be spray painted every year. The winner of the McGill Murphy rivalry ga game spray paints their school colors on the cannon after the game that nearby residents tell us will stay up for a couple of days before being removed. A group uh, bras across the causeway has also painted the cannon pink in honor of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. About an hour ago, a city spokesperson in a text told me, quote, the city does not condone the willful damage or destruction of city property. The cannon was vandalized and it was promptly repaired in keeping with city policy. Reporting live in Mobile tonight, Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News.